Hello there guys, my name is Coast Chai YouTube channel Donksterborn, but built for Theme Park News and welcome to a Theme Park Newsroom update where today we're going to be looking at a second teaser that's been revealed by Legoland Windsor Resort on their brand new world set to open in 2021. So I'm going to recap the new viewers on all the details that we've released already. Uh, at the end of this video, during the end screen for 20 seconds, there is a link to the playlist, which you can go and check out for yourselves, that we've done for this new area. Uh, so that's all the videos, even when it was known as the Lego Movie World sort of area theme, uh, before that theme got taken out of it. Uh, so we're going to explain all about that in this video and explain more about this second teaser as well. So, before we get started guys, make sure you like the video if you've loved it. Make sure you comment down below your thoughts and opinions, because your thoughts and opinions are exactly what I love to reply to. You know I do. And uh, make sure you keep uh, subscribing to the channel, keep pressing that notification bell so you never miss another YouTube video. We're getting closer and closer to 2,000 subscribers and nearly half a million views, which is unbelievable for a theme park news channel. So thank you very much guys for all your support. I've actually gone back and done like a nostalgia binge watch this morning of all my old videos. And you might think I'm crazy for watching my old videos, but um, you know, I can't believe our father's channel's come. And we've only done this channel for like, what, two years now? And um, you know, we've come so far in two years. So uh, you know, that's down to you guys. And uh, for now, let's let's go in about the details about Legoland Windsor's uh, new teaser. And then I'm going to share with you details of what we already knew about this new world. So let's share what Legoland have revealed recently about this new area. So on your screen right now is a little teaser video um, from the park themselves. 30 seconds long, not too long at all. And uh, the teaser page for the website has also been updated with the following text. A parallel universe where mythical Lego creatures come to life before your eyes. From undiscovered lands and things untold to never before seen creatures so bold. From epic battles over raging seas to majestic beasts that guide you beyond the trees. A world filled with creativity and delight. Enter the portal now and take flight. So that was the official text from the website. Again, I will link that beautifully themed website in the description down below that can only be updated from here on out. And I think, you know, I think Legoland Windsor is going to be one of the major new area projects to keep our eyes over it, over winter in terms of revealing new attractions. Because now with the Legoland Movie World theme gone, we don't know the theme of this. However, I've got a pretty good idea what this is going to be. Now, there were some great predictions in the comments down below, which I'll share a lot about as well in this video. Uh, but let's go over some details for those of you who are new to the channel and thinking, why is there a C shaped like a dragon at the top? Um, but for those of you who have not seen much on this project, basically this was going to be a Lego Movie World themed area. It was going to take over a section of area of an old themed area and it included the re-theme of the Squid Surfer, uh, I think a restaurant was going to get rethemed as well. Uh, there was a new flying theatre attraction being invented as well as the old Unikitty drop tower kind of family ride as well. And, um, you know, it was just a, a mixture of new and refurbished rides and attractions and other entertaining offers surrounding this theme. Now, the reason why the Lego Movie theme was taken out is there's rumours and reports because of the Lego Movie World 3 film. The Lego Movie 3 film being taken out. Basically, that been shelved. So they took the theme out, and we sort of didn't have an idea about what was happening. Then when we saw the first teaser, which you can go back and watch that video after this, after this, after you've finished watching this one, you can go check out the other one. Um, that we, I think we uploaded that video what nearly a week ago now, or about about a week ago now. So we spoke in that video about this new teaser surrounding the theme. I immediately predicted Legoland Chima. And a lot of people predicted Chima in the comments down below. There was a comment from someone thinking like a medieval theme, which is a pretty good theme. Uh, but of course, they've already got the medieval castle kind of theme with the dragon and the dragon's apprentice. So I kind of thought maybe not. They'll expand on that. Uh, I think they'll go for something different. And from the sounds of it, I definitely think this sounds more like a Lego Chima theme as well. And, um, you know, this only heightens my prediction of a Lego Chima theme. Uh, and I said in that first, vi well, in, well not in the first video, but I said in that video about a week ago now, I said that LEGO Team would fit very, very well with the Flying Theatre attraction, with the Family Drop Tower, with the Squid Surfer re-theme, uh, with all the other things around the area. It would really, really fit. And I think it's a, it's a certain brand that I've wanted to see at this park for a good few years now. 
Um, so I've always wanted to see some kind of world achievement. It'd be interesting to see if I've got that right or whether it's some kind of surprise twist um, that none of us expected. But I think we're looking here at a Legoland Chima area, which to be fair, I'm not against. I think that the world of Chima would be a perfect thing for this part. Like I said, I've wanted this for a few years, so it's going to be interesting to see how they utilize the branding in specific attractions and the retheme of Squid Surfer. That's going to be a very interesting way to see how they use that in the Chima branding if it is a Chima theme. Um, but from that teaser there, and I showed you the teaser video with no sound, of course, from Legoland Windsor. Um, showed you that video and I think it was very very clear with this new world kind of branding that they're doing for the teaser campaign for this new area uh, we're looking very heavily at a Chima theme uh, so very very exciting stuff from this I cannot wait to see it when it's completed and uh, you know I think from the teaser campaign they've revealed already I think it's very very clear we're looking at some kind of epic theme epic monster you know theme and I think that Chima will fit that branding exceptionally well so again, I'm sticking with my prediction all the way 100%. Mine's that my prediction is a Lego Chima theme for this area. And, um, you know, I think it would be one of the better themes that could have gone for with this area. So thank you guys so, so much for watching this news update on the Chima tease, well, potentially Chima uh, teasing campaign by Legoland Windsor. Uh, for this new area in 2021. Like I said, over the winter season, it's going to be one of the areas to watch and one of the attractions to watch because we're going to hear some form of announcement and that'll be one of the bigger videos from the UK theme parks over this winter period now. So, um, you know, I cannot wait to reveal everything. Reveal all, as we call it. Uh, and, you know, I think once this season is over, we can just... I mean, to be fair, usually I do like a season review at the end of every season. I did it for 2018, did it for 2019. 2020, I'm still debating it because we didn't really have a season this year, did we? So, thank you very much, guys, for watching this video. Make sure you like the video if you loved it. Comment down below your thoughts and opinions on this news update. Make sure you also subscribe, click the notification bell so you never miss another thrilling YouTube video. And for now, guys, my name is Coast Shy YouTube channel. Keep living the coast of life. And I'll see you guys in the next video very, very soon. Take care, guys. Have an awesome day.